Hi, good morning guys. Uh, welcome to my channel. By the way, I'm JP. And if, um, first of all, I would, just, I would just like to thank all those guys who subscribe to my channel and wa enjoying watching my video. And for those who haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe to help my channel grow. And so I can do more unboxing of shoes. So anyway, I'm going to unbox a shoe that is... Um, underappreciated i must say because uh this shoe is really nice in my opinion but a lot of sneaker heads just slap on it so uh maybe because one of my um probably i don't want to say reason or but because uh this shoe came out like a week after the release of Sakai Waffle. So that shoe was very hype and very sought after. So this this shoe didn't get much love. But anyway, I really want this shoe. I think this is really dope. And um, the concept of the shoe is really, really unique. That's why even though there's no hype in it, I got it so uh, that's how I buy shoes I, I don't care about hype sometimes I buy into the hype of the shoe like for example I really like the design but if it's not my thing even though it's hype I don't buy it and plus if it's hype you know it's really hard to get so this one is sitting in uh, nike.com full-size run and I said like take advantage of it because uh, uh, a lot of times when Nike or Adidas uh, release a collab with uh, other artists or brands or um, store or whatever it's really really hard to get and sometimes you have to enter a raffle or you uh, it's a first come first serve basis only so anyway Without further ado, I'm gonna unbox this beautiful shoe. So, see the Nike block box? Yeah, it's the undercover daybreak. So, a lot of uh, videos already uploaded in YouTube on YouTube, so you're not the. Um, you're not new to this so tissue paper and I just wanna I just wanna give my opinion to this shoe so here's the shoe it looks dope right like this thing is really unique so basically it's made out of um, nylon material on the upper and around the toe box you have a very very beautiful suede it's like a long hair suede and around the what they call this like around the laces you have the nylon nylon uh, no nylon I mean uh, the suede also and at the back of the shoe you have this really long very soft suede and you got the logo of undercover and you got undercover by Jun Takahashi on the midsole so it's really nice like it's very simple yet very unique and the swoosh is made out of uh, I'm not gonna lie it's a it's a very thin thin material of leather so I'm not really thrilled about that but the sock liner is leather so that one I really dig so it won't get dirty as fast compared to other materials and 
on the tongue it says there Nike undercover so it's really really nice shoe I don't know why people don't like this or slept slept on this shoe like the Sakai waffle is really nice I haven't seen it yet in uh, person but based on pictures online it's really really dope also but this one is really nice as well right see very unique and the Sakai waffle and this one has the same outsole like the waffle it's just a simple black outsole but if you if you wear this this is a head turner neck breaker in my opinion because um look at the design of the shoe it's really different like uh when when did you last see a design like this with a like a hard plastic at the back that looking like a uh shark's jaw and plus they have a they it has a uh, like a speckle of a uh, gray there so it add more um, character to the shoe so yeah so just look at the back it's really nice and the color combination black and blue is really really dope there is other colors that are, that are coming out I think this week or next week and the yellow one is really nice and there is a I think red red a red one and one that is like a navy blue with a yellow swoosh that one is really 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 nice colorway also but I think uh, I think it's only for women's so if you have a like a bigger feet probably you won't get that if you really like it but if you're I think if you're a man uh, like a 10 in men's size I think you can get those you just need to get the 11.5 women's I think so anyway so that is my uh, short review of the Nike undercover daybreak by uh, Jun Takahashi so do you do you want this do you, or you you don't it depends on you like uh, but for me this one is really nice so that's that's everything for today and um, I'll see you next week because uh, I cop the Nike SB collab with para so that one is really uh, really nice shoe also it's uh, uh, I don't uh, I don't want to say it's really hype but a lot of people want that shoe so I really got lucky yesterday at nike.ca to get that one so I'm just waiting for the the delivery of that shoe and then I'll make a short review also and that's it so probably I'll see you guys on on the next vid next week okay so peace out